I mean, from three dead in that previous game, I killed two. <laughs> and two got really lucky that I didn't get the kill. Atlanta with overpens and ricochets. And Edinburgh on 107 HP. Those two should have been kills. Those two died, I would have had an additional 100 points worth of time to rush in, finish the Scharnhorst, finish second Atlanta, duke it out with the Turpets or Bismarck or whatever it was, cap, and then still probably lose, but yeah. Alright. No tier 10s. But two carriers. Oh boy. Two destroyers. Oh, bunch of battleships. Two cruisers with all the radar in the world. That's gonna be fun. Okay. Oh shit. Read the chat. Ram friendly. You know you could turn Alaska to help me out here. Of not ramming you. I'm just saying. Are you serious? Okay. Alright. Alright. Well, that's a fine. That's a fine. Alright. We can do this the other way. That's okay. That's absolutely fine. I will turn for you. That is absolutely okay. That is okay. You want to pretend I'm not here? I'll pretend you're not there. All right. That's fine. Super special. Super freaking special. Look at this guy. If I didn't fucking turn him from there to here, he would have rammed right in the island. <laughs> oh my god. I seriously have nothing better to shoot than a DD on this range. This ship is just better than Lenin in every possible way, I think. Honestly. I just... Next to this ship, it's going to be impossible to recommend Lenin. Damn, turning. Okay. <clears throat> Dudes. Dudes. Please, look at the minimap. There's no reason to still be going there. There's nothing coming here. Not a single ship. Okay, Fletcher. Yeah, that's the kind of accuracy I want to see on Lennon. If they get that kind of accuracy on the close range on the Lennon, I will recommend it. But as long as I get the same accuracy on mid, long, and short range, that, that is a no. That ship is just going to stay a no. Yeah, that's the kind of accuracy I get on close range with Lennon. So just, no. Ah, oh, bugger, he survived. This 
legit going to wipe my deck clean of everything. Six, five, four, three. Nice. Okay, now. Now that we have B under our control, nice and steady. Gonna need to give these guys like five freaking minutes to become useful. In the meantime, we'll pretend we're at tier 10. Ooh. Are you sure you want to stop it there, girl? Okay. Oh my god, he was broadsiding me. Please pay off. Please pay off. Paid off. Pravitie potvarzdaio. Absolutely. I agree. That's what I was thinking. Uh, okay, Mr. Lennon. Apparently I can lob that according to the game, but I kind of doubt it. Well, some of the shells actually did. Right. Oh my, oh my. Wait, somebody is in B? Hmm. <laughs> now hold on just a second there, gentlemen. Let's talk about this. That guy is abandoning that guy. Much as I'd love to shoot some of you folks. Oh, he left. Okay. You want to turn? Hmm? Jesus Christ, what was that sound? <laughs> Hello, buddy. Oh my god, three overpens? Seriously? It was below the waterline. What were you expecting to find? A destroyer? Yeah. <laughs> Shit out of luck, my friend. Shit out of luck. I do need to pull back though, because very soon everybody is gonna open up on me. Oh, hell no. Okay, we got rid of that dude. Less broadside, less broadside, less broadside. Alright. Let's go. Keep pulling back. Oh my god, that carrier really has a special kind of hard on for me. Uh, not enough lead. Okay, so, so far we got, what, a 3 decaps, 10 planes, 1 kill, 81,000 damage, 1.4 million potential, and the game is heating up. 
We only have one heal left, damn it. Oh, H-E? Somebody's getting desperate. I don't know what you think was gonna happen, buddy, but you're not gonna catch me broadside. Well, if you feel like you don't need extra accuracy, just go for it. Well, I got time. You don't. And just sit tight and... Oh, well, never mind. You did. actually risk a bit that guy fired he's gonna have to give me broadside come on, come on. I am giving him broadside in return as well but this is one of the rare opportunities Let's see if we can use it over pen just one citadel, please. Yeah, there you go. Easy. There we go. Is it me or Sinop that that guy's gonna drop, I wonder? Sinop. Do not have that much HP. Throw it around on two fires. Woo! Not in a half K. Oh, we need to defend the B. You think King George would be a good start? Hey Venom, welcome back. Jesus, where did that torp come from? Because then, you know, besides less ships, better points, actually having a ship advantage. No HE spamming from that guy. That guy's too far. And I think I can just go face first on those dudes. And start slapping them around. But why is nobody shooting him? Hello? Three shells are not gonna be enough. Of course. There's one ricochet. Use the last heal. Okay, finally. <laughs> what he shot me dead? Oh, Buffalo is back.
You had a hard on for me the entire game, buddy. And you still do. Oh my god. I expected that blood to be dead. I'm gonna give it one more attempt. One more attempt. Is, is there, do I even have a team right now? Like, any support whatsoever would be greatly appreciated. I'm dead. No, I lost got potato. I'll drop a plane. Oh, look at the points. Oh my god. Oh my god! Tick, 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 tick! Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> Calculated. Oh my god. Dreadnought. Holy shit. 19 planes, 146,000 damage with a kill, 3 decaps, confederate. We somehow survived this. I mean, even if I died, we would have still won just a bit later. Um, but wow, that was like, oof. Bloody Vostok should have died the first time. And then that Alaska would have died a lot sooner, but he somehow survived that first volley. I definitely pre prefer Vladivostok over Lenin. Lenin's accuracy is just crap on all ranges. It's not super crap, it, but it's enough to be not good anywhere. It's just eh, everywhere. And this thing, not accurate on long range, but man, when you get close, it's... It's what it's supposed to be.